There is a new book for young adults, and it's based on a popular Twin Cities legend. If you've ever walked around Lake Harriet, oh. perhaps, well, see <laughs> the legend. Very the exciting. Elf is coming to life. <laughs> Nothing the book's all over. You never know when Mr. Little Guy is going to come out. Yep, you've seen that uh, elf tree fit with a tiny door. I love it. And kids will leave letters to Mr. Little Guy, the elf who lives inside. I think the book knocked my oh. microphone Oh, off. no. <laughs> All right, we've lost Mr. Jarasha, but local author Tom Sandberg <laughs> used the legend as an inspiration for his new book, Lillian, A Lost Land of the Littles. And we're so lucky to have Tom with us now to tell us more about the new book. Good morning. Hi. Thanks Tom, for did you me. invite the elf in? I don't yeah, know what's going on. Oh, he's around here someplace. Microphones uh, follow uh, missed you. <laughs> tell us how the story of Mr. Little Guy inspired you to write the book. Uh, well, I, you know, he's been down at the... The Lake Harriet for 22 years yeah. answering letters to kids, uh, mm. about 1,500 to 2,000 letters a summer. Oh, wow, that wow. many. I know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, was, he's very busy in yeah. the summertime, too. Yes, Tell so I wanted to, you know, kind of figure out where he came from. And so this book is uh, inspired by where he came from, the cool. lost island uh, called Lillian. Mm -hmm. And uh, there are creatures there. 10 inches tall that ride on cats the size of beagles. <laughs> and Is that why there's a the cat with almost like a throne on the cover? I love yes. it. Yeah, 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 except that's the, the saddle that uh, that they use there. That's one of the, really cool. One of the things I remember about my favorite kid's book, and I'm sure this would have been mine if I had been if born now. It could still be. <laughs> it still could be, but uh, it was uh, my side of the mountain. And the thing sure. was, it, it creates this world that kids want to live in. So what is this world like in this book? Well, it's, uh, it was uh, the the island was founded by uh, Hungarian pirates. Mm. Uh, it has uh, its own sort of culture that happens there. They're very, again, isolated. It's sort of like North Korea, except you want to go to this. You island. want to go. <laughs> very <laughs> similar. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hungarian pirates, very Minor fun. Detail. And so, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. So, so, you know, I, I try to make it as real as possible. And, okay. and so it has this culture that's been created for it and, and how they entertain and what they do and, and, and how they watch out for each other. That's really cool. Yeah. And do you think it's more fun to write about, you know, things like elves and mystical creatures than it is about real people? Well, the, I think the best is bringing both together. Yeah. And so that's what we tried to do with uh, with this book. So who's Lucia? You have my attention because her first name is so <laughs> Lucia, <laughs> Lucia, very close. Very and it, close. It's crazy. I happen to have a daughter named Lucia. Oh, really? And so looking for a, uh, the hero, heroine, the hero for the book, mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's a girl who's 13 years old who invents something and Lillian Island wants to buy it. Okay. So her and her father go to the island uh, and get kidnapped and uh, saved and uh, redemption and intrigue and well, it's uh, a wonderful it's a wonderful part of Lake Harriet and mm -hmm. certainly it uh, it's been a yeah. tradition and a, a cool thing around here for so long. I think it's great that there's a book that people can have to to learn the the backstory. Right. And and available at Wild Rumpus and we have a book signing this Wednesday. Correct. Okay. Uh, 6 to 8 o'clock. Wild yeah. Rumpus. If you want a place that captures the imagination, Wild Rumpus it, is uh, it. The right? premier yeah. uh, uh, children's bookstore in and the that, United that States. That is free Wednesday from 5 to 7. You can go check that out That's in great. the Linden Hills neighborhood. A great, great bookstore. All the information at wccocom links. Really Tom cool Sandberg, idea. thanks for coming in. Thank, Good you. Luck with the book. Thank you. We appreciate it.